Hey, Laura. So here is the exterior of the home. I'm not gonna when you enter, this is the living room on the left side. And looking down the hallway towards the kitchen, here is the stairwell heading upstairs. Okay. The laundry room, which they the said the washer and dryer really stay, like and they were icky. Um, the living room, is eating kitchen the area. Stuff? There's a porch off each yes. side there. Okay, cool. And then the kitchen. And this is the look into the kitchen from the living room. Now this is the porch off of the living room, looking over the backyard. There's that fireplace I was explaining to you, and there's the mm -hmm. blow-up pool over there. There is one peekaboo view of the marsh that you can see. And there's the driveway. Here is the microwave and stove, the cooktop, and then we've got the dishwasher and the sink, and you can see the countertops here, and what they look like and the refrigerator. They have great windows right there. Very large. And now this is a screened-in porch, which is a beautiful large screened-in porch, but it does overlook the neighbor's yard and their pool and their house and their driveway. And this is the dining room, the formal dining room. I thought the di that was probably the best room in the house. And this is your master. It's a large master bedroom, had a large walk-in closet. And then the master bath. You can see the vanity there. And the soaking tub. And then here is the tiny, tiny shower. And that's the landing area at the top of the steps. And this is one bedroom off the front of the house. It's a tiny bedroom, but a good size for a guest. It does lead out to a little porch on the second level. This is another guest bedroom in the back of the house. The guest bathroom, fairly decent shape. The paint could use some touch up, but the bathtub and the shower look to be good. This is what is the junior master. So we have a large bedroom that has a large bathroom. And there's me waving to you. And this is one that I said had the larger shower between the master downstairs and then this junior master on the second level. Did have a great big closet, which you can see is full of things. And you can also see that this is kind of icky. It needs to really get some bleach in there. So this is on that second level porch off the front of the house. And you can see these are the trees where I think you would normally have that view to the marsh, but it completely blocks it. This is the tiny peekaboo view you have. This is the garage space underneath. Lots of space, but it is open. So that it is screened off so that critters can't get in, but you are gonna have some moisture issues. So I wouldn't keep anything down here that you don't want, you know, the possibility of mold growing on. But it is a two car garage, very large, lots of storage.